Mami. Good afternoon, guys. Today is the first time that I'm vlogging in months. Hey guys, it feels super weird to be talking to a camera again even though I'm using photo booth on my laptop right now because I am currently editing this vlog which you are watching I thought that I will give a little bit of background on this vlog because I feel like it's in bits and pieces and to also explain why I've been off YouTube for a few months as some of you have noticed I decided to take a break from YouTube because I just had a lot of things going on in my life which I needed the time out to like settle and now that things are kind of getting under control I decided to start vlogging again so the duration of this entire vlog is some clips which I got when I vlogged in July last month but in the meantime I shall stop interrupting this vlog because there are many 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 beautiful places which I visited and I hope you guys enjoy this vlog Today I'm all the way in the east I just had lunch with my friend at this new cafe called Natune Okay, this is the chicken stew and it comes with bread Okay, this is a rice with bacon and it smells good It's a curry base, I think Yum! So now we're just gonna walk around the east and find some places to take photos and I'll bring you guys along with You're in my shot When this opens, it's 70 years It's like one of Singapore's like oldest confectionery and it looks yeah. like they're renovating It was supposed to have opened for a year and I think everybody was just sad Is this not? One of the most beautiful corridors ever. <gasps> I love the bright yellow door, it's so pretty. <sighs> love all of the plants. Wow, it's been a long time since I've come all the way to the east. So many shops that I'm exploring today. New update since my last video, obviously. You can see that I've cut bangs. And um, we are now finding this row of really, really colorful, beautiful Peranakan houses to take some shots. It's a hot day and we might be getting dessert or tea after this But to be honest, I'm still really full from lunch Look at how pretty this building is We are now here at Juchiat Road Thank you. 
actually from another day when I visited my favourite luxury brand, well, my other favourite luxury brand, Mona. And I basically saw some of the new bags that they had. Not very new anymore because this was vlogged in early July. And I only started editing this vlog like today, 1st of August. So not very new anymore, but it was new when I viewed the bags back then. And I might have brought something back with me. Or actually, I ordered something and I will get it maybe next month. So I hope you guys enjoy this part as well. This is the Regen in Lychee, a really beautiful muted pink colour. And then beside, there's this in Fuchsia, which is a really bright pink colour. And I think that these two are so beautiful. For sure, this one is more like muted, a very elegant colour, whereas um, Fuchsia is a really fun pink. And they just came out today, so pretty. So this is the lychee colour and it's so beautiful. I think that it's a really elegant colour and goes with, like it matches easily with any outfit. And this is in fuchsia. It's a really bright pink, which um, I think is a very versatile pink. It also matches outfits really easily. So pretty and I like that they come in gold hardware now. So here I am introducing another new bag from Mona and this is called The Little Suitcase. So again, this touches on the history of Mona's uh, trunk, being a trunk maker. Okay, I can't talk today but um, basically it's a little trunk and can, you can use it as a handbag or even a clutch. So you just hold it like this. It's a really chic like everyday clutch and you can also put a shoulder strap so you can see that there's hooks at the side to put shoulder strap and I just love it and this is big enough that it fits a phone so that's a huge plus when nowadays the trend is like mini bags and you can't even put anything in the bag other than like a lipstick and a card holder the little suitcase is super easy to open and you can see that it's really really spacious as i mentioned i can fit my iphone 11 plus pro max in the little suitcase and it really fits a ton so i'm loving and again this comes with the little card holder which is something like it's a plus point for these new bags so again this is the little suitcase a classic remake of Mona's heritage. And guys, I introduce you to Mona's newest bag called The Wheel. It is so pretty. It is such a classic remake of um, Mona's earlier bags because they started out as a trunk maker and they actually like made this bag to whole wheels. Obviously, it's a more uh, bigger version than this. This is a handbag, but in the past, they actually had bags like this to whole wheels of vehicles, which is why this bag is called the wheel and it is so beautiful and I love that it represents Mona's heritage. So chic, just holding it like this too. So as you can see, the closure of the bag is so easy to open and this is the inside. So super cute. And oh, and the bags now also come with a card holder for the wheel and the little suitcase. So it's a really really cute add-on.